This video, by any means, is not intended to disgrace the people of India. This is only to address dirty politics, military control and imperialism played by India. By India, we do not mean the people of India, it is an address to anyone that is part of this dirty imperial play. Rolling back the papers of history, Nepal had a bigger empire than it has today, its borders extended from Kingada in the west to Tista in the east. It covered some major parts of China and India. During the Sugauli Treaty, Nepal was tricked into handing over those areas to India and some other parts to China. Nepal is a small country in terms of its area and global power. It is surrounded by the two power ruling nations of the world. They are India and China. Though China has never apparently attacked or tried to invade Nepalese territory, India is a black eye in terms of a land invasion. Though it might sound offensive to some people and I am sorry for that, but Nepal is not the only victim of area invasion and autocratic imperialism. Bangladesh, Afghanistan, and Pakistan are the other major victims of India's terror in territory captivation. India has developed itself in these years to be one of the strongest nuclear active and military technologies powered nations in Asia and the world. Time and often, India and Pakistan have extreme disputes regarding the controversial areas of Jammu and Kashmir. India plays dirty politics in that area increasing hatred between the Indians and the people of Pakistan. There are statements made by the high-level politicians that even Pakistan-occupied Kashmir belongs to them. Indian armies time and often have been attacking the Nepali border areas aggressively. The videos can be abundantly found on YouTube. The government of Nepal seems to have zero care related to its border issues and apparently seems to have made a hidden deal to let off the Indian invasion in border areas. Armed Indian forces have struck the border areas and have displaced the landmarks which claims the borders between the countries. I am making a big statement here taking over and repeatedly analyzing the pattern of Indian Samrajawad. India is terrorizing countries. Yes, absolutely, you heard it right. Though this is completely my opinion and I won't obstruct if you decide to not appreciate or deny what I said. But it is true, repeatedly India has been trying to invade the border of its neighboring countries performing highly suspicious airstrikes, armed forces attack, displacing the landmarks of borders, claiming false terrorist deaths, using media to raise cold wars and imposing border strikes, cutting off trades and many many uncountable. And now it has taken one step further in declaring its new map where it has invaded the disputed Kalapani territory within its map. A serious blow at hashtag back off India has been running in the social medias and why won't they? Though India's has actually set up its own armed military camp at Kalapani but declaring it now as its own territory makes the intentions clear. India is indeed an invader, trying to destroy world peace, exhibiting its military control over small nations. The government of foreign affairs has told that they are concerned by this act of India and will call on a negotiation with the foreign ministers of India. But this is all dumb shit. The government of Nepal has been doing nothing to the issues previously when they were invading and leeching inside the borders of Nepal setting up their own armed military campaigns. If Nepal by any means had taken this seriously, this should actually be an emergency call because declaring the political map invading other nations' territory is beyond acceptable at any level. This is indeed the state of emergency, the people of Nepal need faster and better actions to be taken when it comes to border breaching, and how will that be possible? Nepal is a highly social media active country and is capable of pressurizing the government and even the foreign personnel to be concerned about the issue. The people of Nepal need to call up all their resources, we want you to share this video with the hashtag state of emergency so that these issue gets more attention in Nepal. This would need more media coverage, more social media posts and more video on this issue. Border invasion is unacceptable and is an indirect attribution of the country's show off of its military power. I do not intend to offend any national or international personnel or citizen by this video and the thought about terrorizing nations is completely my own opinion. But, I still believe India should receive warnings from international levels for such pathetic actions against the neighboring nations. Help this video reach everyone and increase the concern on this state of emergency.
we will bring further updates on this state of emergency issue if there will be any plot twist. Make sure you have subscribed to our channel. As promised, we will be bringing a decent amount of content to Nepali viewers as well. I would like to thank an unnamed friend for sending me message about this issue. Till then, be aware and make people aware, thank you.